Circling back around to the coronavirus, wastewater treatment plants throughout the city are testing for COVID-19 every hour. And the Houston Health Department says those tests are starting to see a small decline of COVID. Here's Anayeli Ruiz with some detailed analysis. What you're flushing down your toilet is helping the Houston Health Department track COVID-19. See, doctors say that at least 40% of people who have the virus have no symptoms but they can find the virus in human waste. And in fact, the virus is excreted in your feces and in your urine, and we can test the wastewater and to see if it's there. That is why every hour for 24 hours, they collect samples from 38 wastewater treatment plants throughout the city. And once a week, those samples are sent to labs at Baylor College of Medicine and Rice University. Each sample is tested six times. They tell us this helps spot a COVID resurgence early. It is a very early indicator of what is about to happen with positivity and hospitalizations. Um, it's not an exact correlate, but it is very, very uh, helpful. Lately, these samples collected at the wastewater plants are starting to move in a needed direction. You know, more so than not, the numbers have started to come down a little, but I want to remind folks that they're coming down from a very high level, in fact, higher than what we had in July. But doctors say we're not out of the woods yet. People still need to follow the COVID protocols. Houston Health Department says as we get more equipment, they'll target testing in specific areas and even buildings. So far, they're also tracking the wastewater coming out of the jails, homeless shelters, and even schools. Anayeli Ruiz, KHOU 11 News.